Hi everyone, welcome to Geek Decoders YouTube channel. Today I will show how to add percentage to the tooltip of stacked column chart and this technique that you can use for stacked bar chart as well. So the data set contains salesperson, item, sales value and sales date. So now I first add a stacked column chart to my window report window and then I add the sales value to that and as the first category I add salesperson here right so the x-axis would be salesperson and then as a legend I add item here right so as you can see now if I set the values to be displayed data label so I add that and fill so here as you can see now uh, the stack column chart is filled with the data. Now, as you can see, if I hover here, so only salesperson item and sales value will be comes under the tooltip uh, section, right? Not the percentage. So in here, what I want is to show the percentage if I uh, hover like this. Right, so let's see how we can do that. And for that, we need to create a new measure. Right, so now it's time to create a new measure for that. So uh, here I go and create a new measure. Call percentage. And then what I want is first I will calculate, I will create a variable. And I want total sum only filtered with person. So here, this variable, I will use calculate function and expression. I will need to take the sum of sales value. And as a filtering, I will use all except table and only the column we use as the salesperson so in here so when we filtering from any other column this value will not change only when we filtering from the sales value salesperson only so this value get filtered this sum will get filtered right so this one and then I'll return I will return so here I think there's a small return so first my numerator should be uh, you know based on the filtering I need right so basically it's like uh, I need to use a divide function a sum normal sales value so when we click car or bike so it will filter and then as a denominator I need to use this total value so that will not be filtered so it's the total this is the total and this is the filtered one based on the car and uh, bike so this is uh, will be our measurement for this uh, work right so now the measurement is done so I'll press enter right so here my new measure is there now in this one, I add the tooltip value. There's a value called tooltip here. I will use this percentage value to the tooltip. Let's see what will happen then. If I hover, right, so it will come, but as a, a 0.52 here, this will 0.48. Likewise, so percentage value come, then, but I want to have it's more into a floating value. So I want to have it in the percentage value for that in the formatting I will go and create it as a percentage right so let's see now what will happen right so now I can see clearly the percentage value 52.05 47.95 likewise it will be showing so I hope the tutorial helped uh, full for you and please subscribe my channel for more power bi tips and tricks thank you